Alright. We got no juice. This unit. Nothing on the thermostat. So our power, we got no juice here, no juice, no juice, we got juice. So this is what we're not in power to. Turn this off. See if that kills power. <clears throat> yeah. This is the most ghetto thing I've ever seen. This fuse is busted. <clears throat> Alright, so we got some new fuses here. So, I'm going to thread this in and hope that this thing will work nice and tight. I'm not sure what's going on there. Anyways, this is on. Let her rip and see what happens. Not sure if you saw that, but it's basically art. check my voltage at the fan so between neutral and our heat so heat is this blue wire neutral is there so we're gonna see what voltage we've got and this thing's buzzing low heat oh let's test that one Again. 
120. Nothing's happening. So this motor is bad. Hey. hey. So, um... I put the new fuse in and I found out why it popped that other fuse. Yeah. So the fan motor itself is bad and I can show you with my voltmeter if you want to see, um, just so I can verify. So the thermostat, there's no issues there. Um, basically if I check between this heat wire and neutral, when I turn this on, you'll hear the a buzzing sound and these are, you can see on the gauge, it's got 120 yeah. volts as soon as that clicked on. And when I had it, um, when I put that fuse in, um, I could smell like burning electronics. So that it's getting juice to the motor, but the motor's not doing anything. So, yeah. um, so I don't think any places will be open to get the motor, but thankfully it's not, you know, too cold at night. Oh yeah. It's not. I, so, I mean, I was surprised you were able to come today. Uh, so what, what I can do is just get the model number off of it and then I'll get you a price and then uh, we can reschedule for another day to actually do the work if you want to have it done. Perfect. Sounds good. Blue to heat. Blue to high heat. Red to low heat. Black to cool. And yellow to park. I got this limit switch here. Okay. 
break those loose first. I wonder if this will fit. Oh, dear. Like it was made for it. That's awesome. way harder than it has to be. That's what she said. <laughs> okay. Just gonna transfer this right on over to this guy. That's all we're going to get right there. This motor is a little bit 
deeper than the other one. safety which is nice. It's a good feature. this bad boy back in.
last but not least, we've got five wires to connect. Neutral. Red goes to low heat. Blue goes to high heat. Black goes to cool. And yellow goes to hot park. And that is it. I might tape these here so they don't thing up. We'll go ahead and clean up his flame sensor while we're here. Awesome Streamlight Stinger Switchblade. Do it both ways. One of my favorite tools. Faux oh, show. were a 3 8 which is a little bit different but I'll put a link to a 3 8 
5 16 uh, swappable nut driver in the link as well as all the other tools that I use on a day-to-day -day basis um, if you use any of those links it helps me out a little bit so I appreciate it hope you guys have a wonderful rest of the day and we'll see you for the next repair video later